we are required to calculate net profit ratio from the information given here. The information include net sales, gross profit, office and administration expenses and loss on sale of assets. Now students, we are given gross profit here. We are also given office and administration expenses. Remember, it is a part of operating expense. Whereas loss on sale of asset is a non-operating expense. So first of all, what we'll do is try and calculate net profit. Net profit is equal to gross profit, gross profit minus office and administration expenses. As in this case, this represents operating expenses minus non-operating expenses. And in this case, loss on sale of asset is a non-operating expense. So deduct loss on sale of assets. So we'll have net profit as gross profit is 2 lakh minus office and administration expenses is 50,000 minus loss on sale of asset is again 50,000. So we will have a net profit of rupees 1 lakh. So now students we have net profit of rupees 1 lakhs. The second component in this ratio is net sales. Now here in this question net sales are given to us directly. So students net sales will take as rupees 5 lakh. Now we have both the components net profit is equal to 1 lakh and net sales is equal to 5 lakh. So let us apply the formula for net profit ratio. The net profit ratio formula is net profit upon net sales into 100. Net profit is 1 lakh upon net sales. Net sales are 5 lakhs into 100. On dividing and calculating, we get it as 20%. That means net profit ratio for the given concern is 20%. On analysis, we can say that for every 100 rupee invested, this firm is earning an average net profit of rupees 20.